Watching YouTube videos and coming to a stream gives me whiplash. You go from professional showman, it's a me, mini, I eat hot pasta and lie. It's your collab partner. <laughs> Slowly grades into insanity. I had a, a, a comment on one of my last videos on the clip channel. They're like, you know, I prefer your YouTube persona over your stream one. I was like, yeah, I get that. We're going to play Runic Fable Unicorn Control. Honestly, it's surprising seeing Mr. Log so professional, but I love it. <laughs> I sound professional in my videos, don't I? You wouldn't believe that I make so many erratic decisions based on nothing. Ooh, hard drew into fountain. Add a runic card from your deck to your hand. Oops, wrong one. <gasps> Activate runic fountain? No, not yet. It's all about the dual logs experience. I try my best, okay? I try my best to sound professional. If I use runic fountain, it lets me do it immediately. If I do this one first, it lets me discard one card from my hand. Oh yeah, hi Enna. It's the Enna card. And then draw three. Is fountain no hearts once per turn? Nope, it's a soft once per turn. Fountain's amazing. I love fountain. It's my best friend. Oh god, I drew into terraforming. Oh god, I drew into a terraforming. Discard first. I keep forgetting. I've done it wrong so many times. You have no idea. Special summon. Fable unicorn. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> negate all of his effects. <laughs> I have five cards in hand, so as soon as he uses a card, his effects are negated. <laughs> so how Fable Unicorn works is if we have the same number of cards in hand, all of my opponent's effects get negated. Like during activation. It's like a spell speed 5 negate. It's not a floodgate. It's like a constantly continuous negate. It's the only way to like negate uh, super polymerization, for example. And I can control my hand. Just Kaiju. Yeah, Kaiju is the only way to stop it. But like if you stop it, I'm still playing Runix, you know? He's thinking. He has to use two cards at once. <gasps> it's going to get negated. Doesn't matter what I do. It's gone. This is so Diablic. I know. <laughs> get <Palmer>. negated. <laughs> Are they playing true Dracos? They're probably trying to play true Dracos. He doesn't know. March of the Monarchs. I have to use a card so that our numbers become equal. Has this card ever been meta? Uh, I don't think so. Like, it's always been decent, just not good enough. The Monarch Stormforth? You think you can control your hand better than me? <laughs> Here comes the surrender. <laughs> Oh, never mind. I made a mistake. Yeah, now I have four. Okay, mistakes were made. He did it. He hand boned me. I got crunked. I was trying my best, okay? Don't make fun of me. Oh no, you hand boned yourself. Domain of the Monarchs? Oh no. Usually the same breath as Did you know Darkness Approaches puts cards face down attack? You hear about Fabled Unicorn? Yeah, like, it's just one of those cards where, like, the effect is very, um, unique. So, like, you probably heard it a lot in just, like, those fun facts videos. An actual monarch deck? Oh, <gasps> it's the chair monarch! Wait, why didn't he get rid of Fable Unicorn? Next time it would be destroy a battle or card effect that is not destroyed. Get crunked. He tributed that one. <gasps> it's Ulner! Oh my goodness, guys. It's Ulner in chat. A, a fellow runic enjoyer. Kind of similar to Verlush Vera, you automatically negate something even mid-chain. Who? Vernusilith Vera? Never heard of it. Wait, why aren't they getting rid of the Fable Unicorn? Do they seriously choose to hand rip me instead? When I have five cards in my hand? Six cards, I mean? The Vernusilith Mommy Boss Monster? Oh, one of the new cards. Yeah, that's why I don't know about it. Oh, I shouldn't have given him that one. I too am a runic enjoyer? Excellent. Good to hear, Ulner. Battle phase. Are you going to try to destroy my Fabled Unicorn? You buffoon, you absolute moron. I can just protect him. Target one face up monster. The next time it would be destroyed, it is not destroyed. Once per turn, when a monster effect activated by your opponent resolves, if you control five more earth monsters, you can negate that effect, and if you do destroy that card. Ooh, neat. Hi, I'm new here. I just wanted to learn Yu-Gi-Oh, but I'm out of my element here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> these these two decks are very um uh, they're not super new player friendly. Ooh, okay, okay. Uh, target effect monster opponent controls, negate its effects until the end of the turn. Ooh, I have a graveyard effect. Wait, what? If this card's in your graveyard, discard one fabled monster, and if you do, spell some of this card, banish it when it leaves the field. Ooh, that's neat. Okay, well, oh, how come I can't use this? Oh, domain is locking me out of the extra deck. Um, 2800. Mm, do I have a level 6 monster I can go into with more than 2800 attack? No, I'm still locked out of the extra deck. Uh, 
target one effect monster opponent controls, negate its effects until the end of this turn, then banish- oh, I can't target it because of March of the Monarchs. Uh-oh, time for a deck out? I'm trying my best. Let's see here, give me a second, I need to think. If they draw one card, they'll go up to three, and then I have four in my hand, so I need to go down to three cards. No, I need to go down even more than that, I need to go down two cards. So I'll activate my other one, because as soon as they activate a card, their hand will go back down to two. Is set beaver? I can set beaver. This will give me down to two cards. There, now his effects are negated. I can't target, banish helps them, my life is in shambles. <gasps> oh! Oh my god, yeah, Cosmos is a great counter to Runix innately. That's hilarious. I didn't even think of that. I kept hearing people saying they're like running into Runix everywhere, but I haven't seen a single Runic player yet except for myself. What are you doing? Use the cards in your hand, you fool. You absolute buffoon. Don't destroy my fabled unicorn first. What? You didn't use anything. <gasps> I can finally use one of my runic cards. You absolute buffoon. Draw one card and then banish the top four cards of your deck. Classic modern hand. Oops, all bricks. Activate runic fountain to draw three. What? I only have two cards in the grave? You're ham boned. I am a little bit ham boned. Wait, I can chain runic dispelling? <gasps> my opponent used a card. I can dispel their hand. Bully them? I'm trying to bully them, Aku Meowie. Runic is so toxic, I went against a branded Despy with 100 life points. Nice. I love toxic decks. Can you, like, have fun with the game unless you ruin your opponent's day? That's what I've always said. Called by the Grave is probably not super useful against my opponent's deck. However, I can search during my opponent's turn with Runic Trap. Aqua Meowie approves bullying? Hell yeah. Guess it makes sense for the ED lockdown. I can just mill them out and then lose because I, I'm locked out of my extra deck. Oh, I can just draw into the card that outs. I can just search out the card that destroys it. Duh, that's all point of playing Yu-Gi-Oh, hating your opponent. Activate Runic Tip. Get a Runic card from your deck. Do 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 Runic Tip. Destroy one spell trap your opponent controls. Get Palma. How many does this one banish? That one only banishes one, right? Then banish the top card of your opponent's deck. Tributing my own card, using my own magic against me. Vanities Fiend? Oh, that's fine. I thought they were going to bring out something dangerous. A Vanities Fiend? Psh. Do I have enough life points to survive this? I, I should. Unless my math is completely off. I think I should be fine. 200 short. Not that there's anything I can do. <laughs> if the math wasn't off. Your opponent is about to end his or her turn. Would you like to activate the effect of a card? Yeah, destroy one spell trap your opponent controls. I think the domain's probably a better target to get rid of. Let's be honest. So I can finally negate their effects. Ooh! Ooh, reasoning! So Ancient Fairy Dragon Erratum? <gasps> the Ancient Fairy Dragon Erratum was amazing! Okay, so first up, activate Runic Freezing on Vanity's Emptiness. They have 12 cards left in the deck. Oh, I can mill them out. Let's activate Reasoning to get some more cards in the graveyard. Mr. Spooder Vider, hello there. I am a Spooder Spider. Or maybe I should use Runic Tip first to search out the card I needed. Do I even have cards in my deck? <laughs> no, I have the... I have I have cards in my deck. I play three copies of each of the, the Fable monsters. Is Mr. Laws gonna make a video explain the OCG ban list? No, I don't play OCG. I don't know it well enough. Okay. Auto Mill feels good, right? Let's see, then I can use Runic Tip. I'm gonna rely on the kindness of strangers. Okay, I can search out any card from my deck. Here it is, Golden Droplet. Okay. Activate Runic Fountain. I have eight cards left. Runic is meh. What do you mean Runic is meh? Runic is super based and unbiased. Unbased. Do I have another one? Can I use something else? Okay, I can bring out another card. Let's see, top four cards, and this one gets rid of five, and they have eight cards left in their deck. Hmm. Dispelling gets rid of two cards. Uh, I don't think I can do this. I'll be one off. I can use, I can proc Dispelling this turn. They have three cards left in their deck. I can proc Dispelling to get rid of two more cards. And then one more card left. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> I got three ads. You were calling Runic base. Not even Twitch wanted to hear those lies. L Runic is very based and... Oh, I can do this. I can activate this. I can bring out Fabled Cerebrial. Fabled Cerebrial. Put it in defense position. Activate its effect to come back from the graveyard. Can't you destruction? 
Uh, I don't know if I could use any of my cards. All I can do is put up three cards and stall out one battle phase, hopefully. Because I can't go into the extra deck while Domain is out. They have one card left. All their other cards are banished. They have to win this turn. Otherwise, I win. Do you think they can do it? They have two cards on board and I have three monsters. <gasps> and I can't use any of my cards because they don't have enough cards in their deck for me to use them. Oh, they can't use it. If they draw a card, they lose. Truly the duel of all time. I'm trying my best over here, okay? This deck requires a lot of thought. <laughs> he figured it out. <laughs> He's like, oh no, I can't use it. I did it.